Hey, everyone, this is Brawl here. I'm giving you my live version of My Hero Academia 220. Yeah, 220, that's what it's called. My Villain Academia. And I'm not sure what this going to mean by this, but being from last week's chapter, we've had the cliffhanger moment where it was like League of Villains. We're getting ass kicked by a huge giant beast. Or a villain, I don't think sure, but it looks like the person like the thing can't talk. And it said, all for one, it looks like he's interested in that he's actually part of the League of Villains, but though. Apparently, these guys are getting their ass kicked. And it turns out that the Super Liberation Army, this new one that's before on the shadows, is planning on taking down the League of Villains. But being that how these are basically in the, kind of like in the darkness and took down Garen, it says that they have some very shame methods to do so. Maybe some of the anti villains this series, but let's see more until like when they officially announce what they're planning on doing. But for now, let's get right to it with the chapter. And being says it's called My Villain Academia. I don't know what you mean, Kali, surprise, you know what, Kali, oh, tell, just tell me what you're going to, tell me, what do you mean by this? And we start off with, no car page here, bud. Actually, this one doesn't have, Mario doesn't have a car page. We start with, with Shigaragi, or at least Tomura, saying in the middle, raise his hand, and that says, the hand will destroy everything. Going to this tile screen, he's in cracks, and he takes it. The hand is gone, the hand is moving away. I want to know what this is, my film like the tile screen looks like. Oh, it just breaks the glass screen. It's actually kind of pretty cool. Nice design on that one. Before we continue from where we left off, let's see how let's see how we got to our present situation. Guys who hate chocolate. How'd you get it? They're the League of Mills of guys who look like ch ch cockroaches. In this world, there are those who have various value systems. He can't with the CRX English acronym himself. However, he, however, he did not provide an actual English translation of the Japanese term, so we could guess. So we can only guess the thing he was thinking. What he was thinking. The Japanese name translates to reflection of the grotesque group. They're basically the M H A K. <laughs> wow, he just, he just mentioned that. They're basically the M H A K K K. Well, okay then. We're gonna go that route. If we're gonna go down that route, fine. Fair enough. And then there's many interpretations of infamous people, infamous people, and groups in the world. Persona has someone from Hitler. Persona 2 actually has someone from Hitler. I know that for a fact. And now we have a KKK interpretation. That's just. <laughs> okay. Moving on. They are the Creature Rejection Collation. Otherwise known as the CRC, this generation is coalitions. Coalitions or something. There's a loser with them. How repulsive. As the, name, as the name says, there are a bunch of shitty bastards who stand for the great discrimination and assault of strange looking humans. So they have no qualms with quirks, but only, only those who have strange mutations. Okay. By the way, I'm not fond of the term grotesque either. Although almost everyone uses it on a day to day basis, it should be avoided in foreign situations, at least at the very least. We're looking for things to sell. Is this much how much is, is this worth much? We're just a bit broke at the moment, you see. And yes, I know, it's, it's not cool to be a robber. I didn't want to soup this low either. I love how this is like Mr. Compress is keeping a new mask. It's a sacred ground all of you are all of you violating it. Get out. Tomorrow just grabs him. We'll leave when we're finished. If you don't want us here, then get out of our way. And he comes twice. Toga. Yeah, they got the Deadpool of the series. It's called Twice. Himigo. Toga. Himigo Toga is her full name. Himigo. Mr. Compress. Why? Oh, he just compressed his hand. Jesus. And Tomer. And there's Tomura. I'm a spinner. I'm a spinner. I'm a member of the league. Today, like most days, I'm in compliance and crime. I'm an accomplice in crime. So this is his perspective. Okay. I thought religions were supposed to be profitable. They're probably just scrapping by. Ah. Ah. Uh, it broke. Even our rock arm is squeaking. It's squeaking terribly. I'll need to ask Gear for a brand new one. But we don't have that much money for that, do we? 
it now, do we? How are we going? How long are we going to keep living like this? How is it living con till the very end? If you join hands with if you join hands with Kakazaki, we probably be feasting on sushi. Right? You're kidding, right? Yeah, it's just who would have thought that formal league of the formal league of villains that once terrorized the nation actually looks like this behind the scenes? How can you we possibly face all of our adoring fans? Well, the Doka found something interesting. This is cute. I'll take it. Yeah, I agree. You look like a granny. Toss it twice as sliver. And your guns die. Well, well, the gang's all here. Because I only know who has been do who's been doofully working on great on gathering out, working to gather allies. Yeah, I'm right. I'm all all you've been doing is going around burning people to death. I haven't seen you bring a whole single person back here yet. That's because they're all trash. Not nothing but living, breathing garbage without a shred of ambition in their bodies. I'm sure not just a terrible judge of character. You're the last person I want to hear that from. The league is in shambles. Oh, this is home from Spinner's perspective, not Tomra's, so that's surprising. It's been months since Kokogiri was captured. Oh, Tomura Shigurai. Okay, we're taking a flashback. Now we've lost for one. Now that we've lost all for one, we are succeedingly weak. In order to realize our ambitions, we must first advance to the next stage. He left a great behind. He left behind a great power for us. Ye need only give the order, and I will go retrieve it. This is all for you to say, Tomer Shigaraki. But when all said and done, he failed. And thanks to that, we're here. We're having a real hard time searching for the doctor. Like for a doctor? Hold on. You must be so lonely now that your babysitter Kogiri is gone, huh, Tomura? But hey, what's this doctor guy like? He was master's attend he was master's attending position and a very cautious man. I always came a bit of a backstory who the doctor person is. The only contact we ever had with him was through the computer at our, at our old hideout. He was also one of the who developed and oversaw the Nomu project. How close could one guy be? He could he can at least reach out to us. His employer's fair discipline is struggling over it. Huh. You didn't even deny that we were lo we were lonely Tomer. Now Spear finally speaks up like he's having the way he's tones it. What the hell are we even doing? I'm here because I was inspired by Stain. Huh. I raised in the boon I was raised in the boons where people still cling to their adequate values. I was discriminated against and labeled as the dumb lizard man. And I thought that was just the natural way of the world. My heart was already empty. Until so I saw Stain's last moment on TV, last moments on TV. He was trying to change the world all on his own. That night I discovered for the first time how suffocating this world really is. And knowing that I just couldn't sit still, that's why I'm here. Oh, that guy just went and ran over that sentence. But I give it what looks like Spinner here is actually not too happy about how things are going right now. So basically you're nothing but a stain cosplay, an empty cheap interpretation. You're damn right, I've always been empty! And he's not denying the that he is not he's not denying that. Oh again, relevant close. That's exactly why I can't understand this little attitude, this lazy attitude. I thought we were going to have to blow a huge hole through this shitty society. Answer me, Shiraki! What are you doing? Where are we headed? I told you already. And before you even get the answer to that, in comes a crash sound. As to what it is, I am. We'll get all guaranteed, wasn't it? I certainly finally found you. I've been waiting for the signal. So are you. So you are all for one successor? They don't grab their stuff, but they don't ready for a fight. But look, holy cow! Look at this guy. Holy crap! This that dude is huge. So this is that power, a eh, Kogiri. What's this all about? I can't believe this is what Kogiri was seeking on its journey. Apparently, this is one of the ballots that his master left behind. I devote myself to all for one. Now, successor. Hmm. 
prove to me that you are also worthy of that devotion. And that about covers how we all got here. It was a long explanation, but why? This is terrible. My master, why is he seeing us so weak? And he was literally like bawling tears out. That's some reason for dude his size, he is bawling tears out. What the hell is this guy's deal? What's even happening right now? It sounds like you're in trouble, Shigarai. This is where our story, which has been up to a standstill, starts to take off. And now he hears the doctor. What Shigarai heard was none other than the elusive doctor's voice. Ah. Huh. So that's basically how the end of that story goes to. So as far as... We're gonna see more. We're gonna see more screen time with the villains this time around. So we're gonna put away from all the civilization army and class one A, so UA as a whole, and focus with the villains. And as to who this doctor is, that identity is gonna be completely unknown to us for now. So until then, so until the next chapter, leave a like, subscribe, comment, share with a friend. And I'll see you next time for the next video. Later's.